Hi there, um, welcome back to the Red Flannel. This is your ego with a love reading for Leo. Okay, so let's see what you pull for the week 111 through 115. I think I said 114 on Cancer, Cancerian, so I apologize. 111 through 115 for Leo, all right? Um, Venus and Juno, you can also check your other aspects, your major aspects, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. All right, so let's see, Leo, what you are pulling for love. Ghosted, okay. Um, all right, so I feel like you're ghosting someone all week. You're not, you're not going to talk to someone for the rest of the week or at least, uh, you know, through 11, 111 through 115. So let's see, who, you, who are you ghosting? All right, or someone uh, could be ghosting you. It could be working both ways, but let's see. Uh, Leo, okay, so who are you ghosting? All right. You are ghosting a Gemini, it looks like. Okay, yeah, you just stop talking to somebody all of a sudden, all of a sudden abruptly, it just ends. Okay, yeah, so I'm getting like you're just going to dump someone without any explanation. You're not going to tell them. I just feel like you just dump somebody, you just cut somebody off, just period, all aspects. You know, you, you block them from your phone, all of your um, online platforms. You have no words for this person at all, period. The Seven of Cups, yeah. You're kind of going to leave somebody really traumatized, confused, and like crushed. All right, this person is going to be crushed, okay, when you dump them because somebody is like, what the fuck just happened, okay? So I feel like somebody has no idea why you are ignoring them or why you ghosted them. They're going insane trying to figure out why you left or why you're not talking to them or, you know, where you went. So somebody, yeah, somebody is like watching you constantly. You know, they keep refreshing the page. You're like, yeah, somebody is really, you have somebody going crazy or you have like somebody gone here. Okay, stalking you like crazy. We have the page of pentacles, yeah. Um, so yeah, pretty much that's what's going on. And you have the knight of wands, yeah. So you could this could be a situation where you figure out that somebody betray you and you just drop them like a bad habit. Like, you know, the moment that you find out that somebody's cheating, you just let you just drop them, you just dump them. And somebody's like flabbergasted. They cannot believe what's going on. And we have the ten of pentacles. All right, so I'm getting something about a uh, family, somebody in your family or so somebody in your family is going to tell you something or uh, you're going to find out that this person is like, I don't know, sleeping with somebody in your family even or somebody that you're very close to, somebody on your team. All right, or like, what's the Ten of Swords? Yeah, the Ace of Swords. Okay, yeah, you're, I'm, I'm getting you're going to meet somebody new right after you dump them, though. Yeah, but you're going to find out that somebody has been cheating on you. Uh, yeah, the Four of Wands. What's 